Yes, so yes, so my people, our Lansing governor don't come again. Yeah, the higher below of uh, Kogi State, uh, he don't come. He say, oh, Nigerians, they, they beg him. Say, they, they ask him, make him run for presidency in 2023. He said, they, they beg him. Saying so don't hear their beggars, they the beg now. Nah. Say they are begging too much. You don't hear their begging. Say no go disappoint them for 2023. Say, oh Nigerians, uh, Mr. Governor, I beg count me out. Oh. I'm not I'm not among those Nigerians that beg you. Now where I see you I come beg you. Please oh, if you know you are among the Nigerians that begged him, speak for yourself. Oh. Uh, don't say oh Nigerians, I'm not part of them at all. Uh, he said Nigerians that they need a competent candidate that will unite the country. Is it not the same governor that that's, that said he won't take uh, COVID-19 vaccine and, and told the NCDC that uh, Kogi State does not have um, uh, corona cases? Uh, imagine, is that kind of uh, leadership quality that we're looking for? Hmm? Anyway. Please, so if you know you are part of those that, that are begging him to be presidency, uh, to become the president in 2023, please speak for yourself. So count me out of them. I'm not among them. I beg. Uh, if they, they beg you, make you come put hand in sapphire. You go go put them at me because they, they beg you. Uh, my people have put me under pressure. Uh, therefore, I will listen to their begging. Anyway, he said this while appearing on a program on Channel's television, you know, on Friday. <laughs> the governor noted that Nigerians desire a candidate who will unite the country. He said he believes he has the necessary qualities to perform excellently as president. Yeah. Well done, sir. You are very well done, sir. Quote, the youth and women and all Nigerians including very objective elites are asking me to run for president in 2023 and i believe <laughs> that it is high time that we looked into capacity who can do the job who is going to unify the country and i think they are seeing something in me that they are asking me to come and unite and fix the country end of quote Kali, well done, sir. Well done, sir. I beg, listen to it yourself. Uh, don't forget to like and share and please subscribe. Encourage. Okay, thank you. Nigerians, the youth and women and all Nigerians, including very objective elites, are asking me to run for president in 2023. And I Akika. believe it is high time that we look into capacity. Who can do the job? Who is going to unify this country? And I now think you they are seeing something in me that they're asking me to come and unite and fix this country. My answer will be in affirmative in a few time from now. I want to urge each and every one of us that are urging me to come and run to be patient. Right. We are still it's a work in, pro in, in, in progress and by the grace of God, I am not going to disappoint you when the time comes for me to give a response to that. Okay. Well, we need to leave it at that, but we must sincerely thank you, Governor Yaya Bello, Governor of Kogik State, for talking to us on China's television tonight. Many thanks for your time. Very much. For, thank you very much for inviting me, and I wish everyone of us a united, peaceful, and prosperous Nigeria. God bless all of you. Thank you. That's our I'm <laughs> 